Swedish prosecutors plan to question Julian Assange, the man behind WikiLeaks. They'll talk to him at the Ecuadorian embassy in London over rape allegations, allegations he denies. Now, Assange says the case against him is an attempt by the United States to draw him out of the embassy so he can be arrested for leaking millions of classified documents. Well, Miriam Francois is outside of the embassy in London, where Assange has been living for the last four years. In the last four years, Julian Assange, the founder of WikiLeaks, has been holed up in the Ecuadorian embassy here in London in order to avoid having to travel to Sweden to face rape allegations dating back to a 2010 incident. Today, Swedish prosecutors announced that he will now face questioning from within the embassy itself, something his legal team has been asking for for the last few years. Now, this is seen as very much a breakthrough in what has essentially been a political stalemate between Ecuadorian and Swedish authorities over Assange's case. Assange himself denies the rape allegations and says he wouldn't travel to Sweden out of fear that he would be extradited to the United States over possible espionage charges relating to his work with WikiLeaks.